Hey there, welcome back to the channel. Today we're working on this 1990 Nissan truck and it is failing the emissions test. What we want to test is the O2 sensor down here. The age of this truck, it does not have an OBD connector, so we have to do it manually. So that's what we're going to cover today. To test one of these, really all we need is a couple of things. You need a chunk of wire and you need a volt ohmmeter. This is an oscilloscope, it gives us a little bit more, but a simple volt ohmmeter would also work. I just bought this so we give it a try. This is a one wire oxygen sensor, so we're just going to unplug it here and hook that wire up to it. This one grounds through the manifold and through the chassis. Some of them will have a two wire where the ground comes back on it. You can test them both the same way, but we'll just be using the chassis for ground here. You can see here this is just a spade connector down in there. So the wire I have, I put a female on one side and a male on the other so we can just plug it in down there and bring this wire up where we can get to it. Alright, you can see I just plugged that in here and this wire just comes up so that we can get to it easily. Now in order to test this, the engine does need to be warm, so what we're going to do is start up, let it idle for a couple of minutes to warm up, and then we're just going to check voltage on this line. The voltage should range from about 100 millivolts to about 900 millivolts, should be 100 when it's just kind of idling. When you hit the throttle it should run up to about 900. Alright, now that it's warmed up, what we're going to do is we're going to hook up, we're just going to use this in multimeter mode. I've put the meter up, the positive, to the wire that comes off of that O2 sensor. And I'll take the negative and I'm just going to probe it right into the battery on the negative side. And we'll take a look at this value. Again, at lean it should be about 100 millivolts and at rich about 900. You can see it's running at about 900 millivolts just idling. It really should be around 100 right now. If we open the throttle, that's when it should run up to like 8 or 900 when it goes rich. Open it up a little bit. All right, you can see that it's giving us about 900 millivolts at idle. And when you accelerate, it actually drops, which is the opposite of what it should be doing. So it's running really rich at idle, but when you give it gas, it tends to lean out. So there's something going on with the idle circuit. The oxygen sensor on this is good, but something is causing the idle to run really rich. And when you get it tested, they probably are running it at idle mm -hmm. for the emissions test. Mm -hmm. And that's why it's running super rich at idle. It's not running where it should be. So we know that the oxygen sensor is working, so you don't need to replace it. Now we just have to figure out why it is running rich uh, at idle. Right now we know that your oxygen sensor is fine. And we know that it is running very rich at idle. That's all we've got for you today. Thanks for watching. 